We're also going to create a crossword part two. So start by adding your question. Find the correct animal according to the images. In this case, we're not going to give students a description, but we're going to give them images. So they have to guess the image and write down the correct word in the crossword puzzle. To do this, we have to switch to rich text. And this enables us to add multiple images so our students can start guessing. There are a few ways for adding images in a crossword puzzle. The first way is by just dragging and dropping images here. You can also use this icon to start adding images in your question field. Another way is by scrolling down and here you can add an image. This enables you to add one image. So in this case, you will have to uh, create one image out of multiple images. And this is something you can do with Photoshop or something else. This is a little bit more complicated. My favorite is by using a table. So you're just adding a table with images and then you're going to add the, your words and even a description. I'll show you how that works. So click on the table and start adding a number. So this is image one, image two, image three, image four, five, and six, and then we're going to enter and add an image. So when you're here, click on the image icon and for example, find your image online. So let's start with a butterfly. Choose the image you want to add. And this might be a little bit too big. So click on this cogwheel and then make sure to um, disable automatic and you can do, yeah, let's say we're going to do it 150, done. So now the image is, is much smaller. And we're, doing, we're going to do this for the rest of the images as well. So when you've added all the images in the image field, you have to start adding your words. So the first one is a butterfly. And in the description, we're going to add image one so my students know that they have to find the word for image one right here and i will keep on adding words then again click on generate puzzle make sure to take a look at your scoring options and go to preview to see how this looks like and then you can see here that we have our table with all the images and we have the crossword puzzle when they click on a word or an image or fields in your crossword riddle, they can find the right image, image one, to add the word. And that's it for this question.